Hello everyone, Simply Makeup here, this is V. It is a beautiful, overcast morning. I hope you're having a beautiful morning, night, afternoon, wherever you are. Wherever you are, start from there. If you start wherever you are, you will make progress. If you try and say or think or do, starting from where we are is always a good idea. Because if we try to change that by saying we should have done this yesterday, then we are now creating a discord. Because what we did yesterday is already done. Trying to fix yesterday is just a headache. Yesterday is no longer in our existence. We cannot bring yesterday back. Yesterday is in the review mirror. Take a look at it from the review mirror. Figure out what you can change today for today. What you couldn't change yesterday no longer works for you. It's a new day, it's a new page, and you write new things. Take care of yourself because you have only one soul, one body, one life. You see you always. You are with you always. You cannot hide from you never. You have to take care of the person you are looking at in the mirror. Only you know your needs. Only you know what you need. Only you know how to care for yourself. If you need help, find it. But take care of that person you're looking at in the mirror. Because you are all you have. Life seems long. But in reality, life is short. Do what you have to do now. Do it safely. Do it in baby steps. Do it even if you're not happy doing it. Because some things in our life, when we are trying and working on fixing things in our life, they're not good. They don't look pretty. They're ugly. We all have some ugly stuff. We all are carrying some ugly baggage. So the work will not be easy because first we have to navigate through all that ugly stuff in order to get to the beautiful stuff. But while navigating through the ugly stuff, add a little bit of happiness to your mind to your heart, to your soul. So that will encourage you and give you power and strength to clean up the stuff in your life that you don't need. Some things in our life we don't need anymore. We need it when we were younger and it helped us. But now we don't need it. We have to pay attention to the things we listen to, 
through the things we watch because some of these things seep into our system and then it takes a while to get it out so please do things in moderation keep a balance going too far left will tip the scale going too far right will tip the scale try to find a balance where things are not tipping over we are important very very important to us first without us without you without me there is nothing there is nothing and that's why it is important to recognize that you first and then help everybody else you first and then you can love everybody else but you have to love you first if you don't love you you cannot love me or another it just doesn't happen because it will not happen and it cannot happen because if you don't have love to give you cannot love someone else that's just how it works it's like if your fridge is empty and has nothing to eat or drink you can go in there and get something to drink or something to eat it doesn't have anything it's empty so what makes you think you are different you are no different you have to put good stuff the stuff you need into your soul into your body when you do that you will be able to pull stuff out and give it to others it is important to share but we have to be able to share what we have not a make up what we have oh i'll give you this but you know you don't have it but you pretend to have it and give it it will be received in the same way that you give it if you give something you don't have people will soon sense that because then they are empty and they are unhappy they are angry you should never give out what you don't have self first i grew up in a country way back when there was no light no electricity flowing through because they were not able to get electricity to us but that didn't prevent us from having light we had candles we had kerosene lamps and we would make something called buzai an empty bottle but it had to be a glass bottle put in the kerosene in it take a piece of cloth roll it around until it was thick enough to last a while and screw it in the top of the bottle then tilt the bottle enough so the kerosene which is the liquid in the bottle can saturate that piece of cloth and then we light it and we were able to go distance with that we would go to the outhouse toilet at night with it and once we done we'd out it so again when i say you can't give out what you don't have that is an example whenever that buzai and people call it touch now but we call it buzai whenever that buzai had no kerosene in that bottle no matter how many times we tilt it towards that cloth 
and light it, it would never light. And why? It was empty. Empty vessels. Empty souls. Empty bodies. Empty minds. Empty hearts. Cannot give to another. Fold yourself up. Refill yourself. Replenish yourself. And then share. Sending hugs to you. And I hope you're having a fantastic, fabulous, precious, prosperous day. Talk to you soon. Bye.